Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Dennis and today I'm gonna share with you one secret trick for your photos to look sharp as beep. <laughs> Alright, let's just jump into the video. Okay, so we are now in Lightroom and I'm just gonna show you like a super quick edit. I'm gonna use one of my presets. I'm gonna use Dia's Love Wash. This is a preset of the collection of Cape Town. You can actually buy these presets on my website, just a small ad. I'm gonna bring the exposure down. I think minus 15 looks pretty okay. I think the photo looks already pretty sharp. If you look at the details, you can see really a lot of details. Of course, I haven't done any kind of retouching of the face or so, but that's the one thing that I would usually always do before exporting the file, especially before exporting for my Instagram or for the client. Actually, I do it all the time when it comes either for the portraits or... Basically every photo, I would say. But watch out. So you go here up to radial filter. I'm just gonna make it a little bit bigger and gonna center that. And the next thing, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring the texture up let's say to plus eight, don't overdo it because if you do it like this, you know, it looks already pretty, like way too much, I would say. We can do it a little bit more, I would say now, let's say plus 13. Then next thing, you bring that clarity up, also don't overdo it, I would say plus eight. And then the last thing is, you would bring the sharpness up. You can lift the sharpness quite up, I would say to up to plus 60. And that's it. You can either press O so you can see which area you're affecting and the feather is right now at 50 so you know if you put it to, to zero the edge it will just look like yeah I don't like it. If you slide the slider up to 100 the transition will be just be a way smoother but I think that the 50 looks pretty pretty well so the center is affected the most so I'm gonna do it just a little bit smaller and press O. Okay, so we can check how it is if we remove it. So actually now you can just like play it around. I mean, I mean right now we have one portrait, so I'm going to leave it here. But if you zoom it in, sorry. And if I remove it, you can see the difference. I think the difference is pretty amazing. Okay, and that's it. That's one trick for one portrait. And that's it. What a magic trick. Guys, I hope you liked it. And I think we'll see us in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Ciao.